What's going on everybody? It's your boy Mitch Y'all Kicks back at y'all with another vid. But before we get started, I just want to thank those that subscribed and have been commenting. I really appreciate the support. Trust and believe it does go in a long way. Now, if it's your first time watching, please consider subscribing to the channel and turning on those notification bells. That way you know exactly when I'm dropping my next one. So as we move to business, we do have BAM! Air Jordan Hairs. On day. After being pushed back a few times, these finally released June 17th for 190 US dollars. Being that foot shops are temporarily closed around my city, I was able to pick these up online, coming in in a very detailed special box with the image of a carry, which symbolizes the whole hair theme. Let me let you in in a quick little fact. The hair color scheme was originally originated by the Air Jordan 7, which launched on 1992. So as we dive right into it, the shoe does feature white leather overlays against these light gray underlays all across the base of the shoe. All right guys, as we swing upwards in the shoe, we do have a black Jumpman logo against red. And something cool about the shoe is this lace lock. It's a carry themed lace lock. As you can see, we do see the colors of orange and a green top, as well as a translucent tongue with the iconic hair print. We would also find red pods in our midsole, which adds that extra touch of color. As I flip the shoe over, we also have a purple Jumpman and our outsole is red, purple, and green. True to size should be good, but I tend to go a half a size down, being that I do find that I have extra room around the toe box area. If you guys feel the same way, please let me know in the comment section below. The more I look at these, the more I kind of want to compare them to a shoe that I already own. Stay tuned for that. But enough all that. Time for some on feet and b bro. Alright guys, that's all we got for today, but please make sure to like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. Now, I want to know if you guys were able to secure your pair. These surprisingly sold out instantly. Cop or drop, comment down below. In my opinion, these are a go. Alright, hold on, hear me out. Especially if a white Jordan 6 is missing in the collection. Which brings me to my next point. I do own a predominantly white Air Jordan 6 in the maroons, which is an OG classic, of course, we all know that. It does bring the hairs on the fence with me. So I'll ask you guys, if you had to pick one, which would you choose? But don't get me wrong, for now I'm definitely holding on to these because they do have that fun, funky vibe that I'm kind of feeling. And with that said, we'll knock down another one. Until the next one, peace, love, and I'm out. One. And they say if they say if we'll only avoid avoid any confrontation with the enemy, he'll forget his evil ways and learn to love.